Hi guys, welcome back to Tarlatch Time. Today I am here with a very special guest, Hessim. Hello. And I'm calling him a special guest because he is, besides my ex, the only person who has met me in real life. <laughs> yeah. So, are you ready for your questions? Yeah, go ahead. Alright, so first one, as per usual, is how long have you been playing? Um, if... I, I, down to the month, I have September of 2008. Holy I don't know really... Crap. I don't I don't know how that pertains to, like, generation or, like, how long after beta or whatever. I but mean, I remember... It's still yeah. accurate. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and that was on uh, your other character. Yeah, my other character, it's almost exactly the same. It was, it was Jessam instead of Hessam. Yep, exactly. And I actually had people recommending to do, you know, Jessam. So mm. technically, well, here you are. <laughs> yeah. Even if it is on Hessam. Yeah, I, I just got back into that account today, actually. So what was the story with uh, Jessam? Um, so I, of course, started that character way back when. Um, and I played it for a long time. Um, had a lot of fun. Uh, that was in Bliss for basically the entire life for that um but then i i, I don't i wouldn't say i got into a bad crowd but i, I found something weird that happened mm -hmm. um on the on the cash shop um i'm not sure if you've ever gotten it in your browser and accidentally hit f12 and you see all the code pop up uh, Ooh, but, no. but you, you, you used to be able to go onto the purchase page of the cash shop and actually edit the price of the annex cost to zero and oh, wait, you hit seriously? purchase and it would work yeah and oh. I, I did that for m many, 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 many gachapons. More than you'd ever ever have in the lifetime of your account. I mean, yeah. <laughs> um, um, but I think the reason that it, it got caught was um, there was a particular player. I won't, I won't name anybody else, but... Yeah, no, that um, would be a good they, idea. They started buying those... Um, you remember those star scepters that were purchased to donate to, like, Children's yep. Hospital? Oh, no. They thousands of them. Thousands of them. Oh. So Nexon was donating money. And they're probably, they were probably like, okay, so what's going on? And they found all the accounts doing that and banned everybody. And we were actually unbanned earlier last year. Oh, I mean, yeah, that's yeah. actually kind of cruel. <laughs> like, they were trying yeah. to donate. Oh. Yeah. Wait, did you do the, the, the like, Starlight Scepter thing, too? Or? I, I didn't. I didn't, though, because okay, I kind I wouldn't, of foresaw that. <laughs> but I, I wouldn't be yeah. mad at you if you did, because, like, you were a kid. Yeah, so. I mean, but uh, someone else did, and there was a particular time where they were, he was just dropping them in Dumbarton. You oh, might okay. remember seeing them everywhere, but they were all uh, over the floor. Yeah, I don't. I actually, I don't have my Starlight Scepter anymore since I got hacked. Mm. Oh, man. So, and I can never yeah, get that, that was back. That. It was, like, it was like, like a year later, my friends were like, hey man, come play Mabby again. I was like, oh, I don't want to do that. Uh, but then I did, and here I am now. <laughs> <laughs> the story of everybody's lives. They're like, oh, I'm yeah. going to quit Mabby. And then like a year later, it's like, oh, I miss Mabby. <laughs> I'm going to yeah, play it again. Yeah, pro tip for all the new players out there. You can't. Can't quit. <laughs> can't quit. Yeah, once you get into it, no, there's no going away. No. Like, you, you, you could say you quit, but like, you're going to go back. You'll be back. As long <laughs> as the servers are up, you'll be back at some point. And you know what? We'll be here. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be here to say hi. We'll be here, standing in Dunbarton somewhere, guarantee it. <laughs> Just AFK. Mm -hmm. So wait, maybe we won't be there to say hi, because we'll be AFK. But you know what? Our soulless bodies will be. Yeah. yeah. And then if, <laughs> if you're quick enough, you might be able to find us walking past our computer. <laughs> or tabbing back in. Mm -hmm. To check the auction house. Yeah. All my stuff sold yet? Nope. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Uh, anyway, uh, what is your favorite color? My favorite color. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, I I like a few. I clearly like white and gold. Like mm -hmm. that aesthetic to me is just awesome. Shiny. I have a lot. I have a lot of equipment that's just white and gold. I like the regal angelic look. Um, you but like as far as just like glowing. <laughs> yeah. As far as I like, I like blue and purple though a lot. Oh. Okay. Like just uh, together or just chill. like alone. Separately, I like purple in it in itself, and I like blue in itself. Okay, that's cool. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and you're after an even shinier armor. <laughs> yeah, I have to wear this robe. While it looks really cool, I have to. 
Oh, I, I, need, I need the armor. <laughs> yep, I that's need... <laughs> uh, yeah, <laughs> not shiny enough for you. No, I'm saving up for it. Almost there. Yep, you got it. Don't worry. I... Don't worry, you'll get it. <laughs> but let us actually talk about the story on how we met in real life. <laughs> oh yeah. Sometime. Okay. Yeah, I don't know I, if you yeah. wanna. If you wanna start it, I can start it. I mean, I can talk about what I remember of it. Yeah. I don't know. I don't remember how many years ago it was. I don't. No, I don't. I, yeah. I think I was. I want to like, say. T- I think I was under fifteen years old, honestly. Yeah, I want to say two thousand twelve, two thousand eleven, maybe. Yeah, that. I think that makes sense. Yeah. Something but like that. we had come under the realization that we both attended the same online school, mm-hmm. um, and they were doing a field trip over to Victoria, right? Oh yeah, because and, we're in uh, Canada, by the way. <laughs> yeah, yeah, oh, well, yeah. he's not, but he was. Yeah, I moved, but um, we both went. Uh, I remember there were being some weirdness where you're like, oh, I don't want to tell my parents or something like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, um, because my parents were very uh, very strict about like, talking yeah. online and stuff. Meeting people from the internet was still kind of sketchy back then. Yeah, exactly. I mean, it still is, but um, yeah. I guess not... Not for, you know, I'm an adult now, so it's just yeah. whatever. Yeah. And from what I remember, I mean, it was a cool trip to Victoria, but uh, <laughs> the gist of everything, we were still super awkward kids. Yeah, like, um, I don't, I think we took only maybe five minutes out of the whole trip. Yeah, it was, it was an entire, it was an entire day trip and none of us, I mean, I guarantee we both knew who each other was, like, pretty early on in the day. <laughs> yeah. It was, um, I remember it was that. hard to, to figure out, I feel like, because yeah. you were that guy with like the, the really long, curly brown hair, and then mm-hmm. I was the one that had a twin sister. Like, that's not yeah. hard. No. And, yeah, we spent, like, I think it was, like, the last, like, quarter of the day, like, we did talk and hang out. Mm-hmm. And like, uh, uh, I'm, glad, I'm glad that I did. Yeah, but yeah. It was really it was awkward, just, though. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I remember talking about, like duped hebana robes and stuff yeah oh yeah i remember i remember doing that yeah <laughs> oh you did oh well <laughs> I, I i probably did at one point i i did have lo- another that's another rabbit hole <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah okay. i've i've been in the bad crowd before yeah you've done some things but you know what yeah you're, you're cool you're cool you're... i've never done anything malicious with it i can tell you that You've only done it for fun. Yeah. And I never, I never yeah. ruined the experiences of other players at any point at, yeah. in my entire 11 years of this game. And it's not like you and do let, anymore, right? Yeah. No, absolutely not. Absolutely not. I don't even <laughs> mod. I don't even have mods anymore. Like, I, as, as much as people would try to quote unquote keep a secret from Nexon, like a, Abyss and whatnot, <laughs> I don't even use that anymore. Ha ha ha. I don't. I don't know what your CP is. Secret. <laughs> <laughs> um anyway uh what is your favorite npc oh man um i off the top of my head just to, just to, for the sake of answering the question yep. um i want to say um agnes actually the healer here in emain uh because of her music oh okay yeah it's, her, it's her really team. nice yeah her, her her just npc music when you talk to her it's oh, it's okay. really nice i'd recommend yeah. people get up and listen to it yeah for sure and, Hamlet's theme song is really cool too. Oh, but we don't talk about the the theater missions. Come on, no, <laughs> the theater generations, yeah. Shakespeare. Yeah, but I'm, I'm uh, like as far right? as a, yeah, as far as like an NPC like for for their character, I mean. Yeah. I don't know. I think I like Nelly too, the, the bard guy here in Emain. It seems He's like a... you have a really big thing for music being related to NPCs. I, I I enjoy I enjoy pleasant sounds. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> um, yeah, I, that's, that's why I played. That's why I started the game initially because I I saw an advertisement uh, for this game. It's like, oh, you can play music, and that's really cool. Jeez, and then that's, that's just like that's just like Anya. Yeah, and I, and, uh, I was watching one of your other videos, and someone else had mentioned that too. Yeah, it was a yeah. big thing for a lot of people. Mm-hmm. Yeah, including myself. So yeah, I, I I understand. Yeah, what is your favorite animal? Cats. 
Like, no question. <laughs> just, just cats. Yeah, I, I've I've had my cat now. She's almost five years old. I love my cat so much. Sorry for the Discord noise. I forgot to turn off the notifications again. I'm kind of stupid <laughs> sometimes, but it's okay. <laughs> uh, is there a certain breed of cat that you like? I I think Bengals are pretty cool. I mean, my cat is like is if if cats could be mutts, mine is as far as it could be. As a mutt, she's just a generic tabby cat, but. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to turn off this notification sound because people are spamming me suddenly. What's your favorite dungeon or shadow mission? Ooh, um. Oh, what is it? it this is music related again. Um. So, Albi uh... Albi Dungeon in Turn of Nog. Oh, okay. It has really cool music. Um, mm -hmm. and I also like Rundle Dungeon because it's actually really cool looking. It's okay. kind of like the, the platforms over the water and everything. Oh my gosh, guess what? I can hear your notifications through your mic. Oh, you can hear mine? Oh, goodness. <laughs> oh. Here, let me turn mine down, just oh, for now. This is going to be known as, like, the Discord notification video. <laughs> yeah, right. No, my uh, roommate was asking. He, he just downloaded Mabinog, and he's asking what race he should choose. Oh. What's yeah. your favorite race on Mabby? Uh... I mean, human. It sounds yeah, obviously yeah. Humans are. You can't really say they're superior anymore because back when super booming back in the I, someone else used this terminology back in the bliss days. Mm -hmm. uh, humans were the best. Like there wasn't a there was, as far as end game stuff. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, at, at the time, there's no reason to be any other race. Mm -hmm. But now the giants are just so strong with melee and elves are. I don't know. Elves are cool, I guess. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, elves are cool. <laughs> that's that's I, I the never really, I never really played an elf. Yeah, very much. I, the second character I ever made was an elf. But I think that's most people, too, that mm -hmm. played this game for a long time. I wish I could run that fast, though. Yeah, I mean, you can, kind of, now, since they have, like, the fleet feet and stuff. Yeah. If you actually, like, yeah, if you stack the Fleet Feet and, like, secondary title, let's say you get the lovely Cupid title in there. Oh, uh, yeah. Get that, the, uh, I have it, actually. Where is it? Large totem bag. The one totem, what's it called? The Goose Feather. Mine's only 1%, but mm. there's faster ones. I guess if you stack those all up, maybe. Maybe you could go <laughs> at a better speed. Like an elf. Maybe. So, what is your total level? Ooh, let's see. Um, as of recording, we are at 5,786. Um, given, given how long I've played, super low. Yeah. In fact, yeah. <laughs> most, of, most of my group of friends that I normally play with, even when I played a lot beforehand, I was always a lot lower than everybody else. I tend to gravitate towards the... Uh, I would say the hardcore min-maxing players, but I also have the uh, uh, tendency to be casual as well. So I, I I try to be both, but it's really hard. <laughs> yeah, I can definitely see that. Yeah, I like hanging out, but I also like being strong. Mm -hmm. And both take time. Yeah, they really do. It's hard to balance them both. Mhm. Mm but it's possible. Yeah. If you have the time for it. And I, um, I spend a lot of time just screwing around with stuff, too. Yeah. It's the same for me. <laughs> <laughs> so, do you have... Since, since we keep bringing Bliss up, yeah, it seems like you were a big part of that. Um, yeah, it was funny how I joined, because, I mean, for those who know, it, of course, became a very significant guild. Mm -hmm. I normally tell people that I talk about Mabinogi, too, like, in real life. I was, I, you, you could argue it was the strongest and most influential guild in the game at the time. Um, yeah. And the, the way I joined was, I, I remember playing, I was level like 30, 35, cumulative. Um, and uh, there was one of the players, his name was Light. Um, him and Saris were walking down from Albi Dungeon and I was killing foxes. <laughs> and uh, I remember them walking up in their, in their like nicely dyed blue garbs or whatever. Uh, Light was wearing a starry wizard hat, I remember that. Oh. And uh, they're just like, hey, do you want to join our guild? I was like, sure. I was like the seventh member or something like that. And then Bliss 
got really huge. It was kind of cool. Oh, wow. Yeah. I didn't know you were in that guild like that early on. I don't even yeah. rem remember you being in that guild. <laughs> yeah, no, I was I was in that guild super early. Again, uh, kind of like how we were talking about before, I was more of a casual player. Mm -hmm. Everyone seemed to have this stigma around Bliss where everyone was kind of mean. Um, because of the I, like the camping and stuff? Yeah, there was, but there was a lot of... Uh, uh, there's a few instances where I would appear at a dungeon entrance or a shadow mission and people would be talking about Bliss and they'd say, hey, that's the nice guy in Bliss. That guy's uh -huh. not an ass. And I was, I was like, oh, thanks, guys. That's but, cute. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah, this was it's a, good to know that you were you were the nice guy of Bliss then. Uh, yeah. <laughs> no. Uh, with, within the guild, they would... they. Uh, uh, I, I had the nickname, uh, not really a nickname, but people would uh, occasionally say, "Hey, I'm the, I'm the guy who was friends with all the noobs." Aww. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> but you're those really are... easy to get along with. Yeah, I try to be, but uh, those are some of the longest time friends I've ever had. All those guys in Bliss, I still talk to them occasionally. I, I still, uh, I still uh, say Merry Christmas to Saris every year. Wait, you have <laughs> contact with Saris? Oh, yeah. Ooh. <laughs> that gives me <laughs> I, ideas. I mean, I, we don't we don't talk. Like we we don't talk often, mm. but like we we do say, "Oh, hey, happy birthday or Merry Christmas," you know, stuff like that. That's really sweet though, yeah. Yeah. I appreciate him for being the leader of that guild. Mhm. Mm definitely. Um, so on that subject actually, uh what did you want to talk more about like uh, who, you're, who you'll remember? Um, like uh, names, names you might remember. Um, not necessarily. Um, I mean, off the top of my head, when I when I think of playing during the Bliss era, was uh, you know, of course, uh, Saras being the leader and all that. Uh, There's a few events that had happened uh, with the guild that were particularly hilarious. <laughs> um, one of which I think is kind of uh, mean to a current player, so I don't, I don't really want to talk about that. Oh, okay. That's um, fine. But it was, it was it was basically a group harassment. Oh, um, mm. yeah. While it was funny at the time, it's it was still mean. Yeah. Um, so we'll we'll skip over that. But oh, I remember <laughs> du dueling a lot. That was one of the things that I liked the most because um, before the update, where player characters were no longer stunned by attacks, really. Yeah. I I liked doing a dueling a lot because you could it was more so skill based than it was actually your actual character strength. Yeah, uh, cuz exactly. I could I could I could take on people triple my level and it, it just because I was better. Um, skill wise, I, yeah. I, yeah, I had like a like a 78 79% win rate it being like level 1500 cuz just I I could kick your ass better. <laughs> <laughs> um, but it was a, it was a lot of fun. I remember teaching um oh, what was his name? It was Sky X Limit. I don't know if people oh. remember him dueling a lot. He was, from what I remember at least, uh, from what I perceived, he was one of the best duelists around at the time when he was in his... In his. But I taught him how to duel initially. Uh, his his ping was really low. So he oh. was able to pull off some nutty combos. That was awesome. Yeah. That would be really tough. Yeah. Now, I didn't do much of the PV, like the elf and giant PvP at all. Mm -hmm. Just because I didn't want to stand in Dunbarton and get hit. I, it was just annoying. Yeah, <laughs> but I yeah, did most of the dueling. A lot still of fun. some people nowadays that do that, where they'll just keep their elf versus giant PvP on. Yeah, I forget it exists. <laughs> I see someone just randomly just get whapped by something. I'm like, oh yeah, you can do that. Yeah, there's that thing, that thing called the uh, PvP. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but uh, since they changed the uh, the stun, I I haven't I haven't dueled since. Yeah, is it? Uh, just from like the combat change. Yeah, they, they I changed like loading up your skills and stuff. Yeah, well, like in a duel, you used to be able there. There was calculations based on the type of weapon. There was a certain specific amount of time someone would be stunned for upon taking a hit. I think charge would stun you for like 1.8 seconds or something like that, and like a mm -hmm. basic attack from from a from a broadsword would do like. 0.5 seconds of stun, and there that that would match up with the load up times of other skills. Um, yeah, and that's where you'd get your combos out of. Um, and now the stun time is milliseconds, and while it, I think for the 
newer players or people who are like really really into the pvp i think it's cool uh but i'm just not that fast anymore <laughs> yeah i can see that being the case i mean like with, with all the new stuff mm -hmm. i like um, pve sorry <laughs> yeah i like i like pve player versus monster player versus enemy yeah me too <laughs> <laughs> when i do fight <laughs> Yeah. Because, you know, when an fashion ogre. When an F. When an F. <laughs> uh, so, uh, last question. Uh, I usually like to end it on this question. Do you have sure. any advice that you'd like to give people? It could be life advice. It could be game advice. Mm. Anything like that? Um, you know, I, something that, that applies to everything. I mean, mm -hmm. uh, it's it's pretty cliche, but I mean... I like to say to, to talk less and listen more. Oh. And that applies that just applies to everything. I mean it's hmm. it's it's better in your job, it's better in, in social interactions. Uh I mean it could help in game. <laughs> yeah. Um okay. But it yeah. That's you could be that's, in that's some what, drama and then Yeah. It's just, like don't just, talk. <laughs> just don't say anything. You just don't need, uh, the way I see it is I mean you don't need to you don't need to use your own personal energy if it's not really gonna I don't I don't want to say like don't try and change things but like sometimes things just aren't worth it yep exactly just move on if you can be the, be stronger about it mm -hmm. that's actually some really good advice yeah yeah <laughs> <But yes>. <laughs> <laughs> thank you for doing this yeah of course it was a lot of fun actually yeah I always have fun doing this. It's like, just, uh, I have anxiety, so it's pushing oh. that. Story of my life. <laughs> no, yeah. ser seriously. <laughs> it seems like a lot of people on Mabinogi have, you know, anxiety problems and such. It's a, it's a good place to, to cope with that. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you're still recording, but I mean, yeah, yeah uh, I'm still anxiety, recording. And, anxiety and depression is a, a huge thing, a huge part of my life. Um, and especially in the recent few years, it's been especially difficult. But uh, yeah, I, I, just to kind of, as a general message to people, if, if they're going to watch this, it's just, I mean, it, you, you can get through it 100%. Oh, it's yeah. tough. Oh, yeah. And just re something that's helped me a lot in, in, in instances where I'm having anxiety or even just a moment where I'm just excessively depressed, it's just, just reach out to whoever and want, to whoever you, whoever you can, whoever you're comfortable talking to. Mm -hmm. uh, your your friends love you. Your family loves you. And oh. just just talk, just talk to them. They'll help you out. Yeah, that's very true. Yeah. And you know, if you don't have friends and family that are there, there's usually um, like mental health clinics and stuff. For sure, for sure. There's always and hell. Help. Even even in Mabinogi, just go talk to somebody. Yeah, yeah, People. exactly. We have the the amazing thing called the internet. <laughs> yeah, I love the internet. <laughs> Me too. That's why I use it. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah <laughs> so I guess uh, that's that then awesome awesome well this is right. again a lot of fun good stuff yeah, yeah. Uh, I will see you all in the next Tarlatch time goodbye <laughs>